Welcome along. We start this weekend's Ligue 1 roundup by the Stade Gelandre, where Lyon kept hold of top spot after beating Nantes. Nabil Fakir with the game's only goal at 67 minutes. The Lyon frontman forcing the ball home after an almighty scrap in the visiting penalty area. Fakir's ninth goal of the season, earning Lyon a narrow 1-0 win. That's now 11 wins in their last 12 at home. Paris Saint-Germain had temporarily taken top spot on Saturday after beating struggling to lose at the Parc des Princes. Adrian Rabiot made the most of a rare start with a fine finish to round off a lovely PSG move on 27 minutes. The 19-year-old midfielder netted his second of the contest just after half-time, poking home a Javier Pastore cross to double the capital club's advantage. Wilson Benyeno pulled one back for Toulouse shortly after. Ending his 898-minute goal jout with a header at the back post. The captain, Thiago Silva, made sure of the three points for Laurent Blanc's men on 74 minutes. Letting in substitute Jean-Christophe Bahavec's free kick for his first league goal of the season. PSG 3 to lose 1. Marseille lost ground in the title race after a dramatic Sunday evening trip to Saint-Étienne. Max Langredel put Saint-Étienne ahead on 54 minutes from the penalty spot after Roman Hamouma was fouled by Jeremy Morel. But Michi Batshuayi made an immediate impact off the bench with two goals in three minutes to turn the game on its head. The Belgian making the most of a second chance on 64 minutes to equalise before turning in a fellow sub at Romain Alessandrini's low cross to put Marcelo Bielsa's men on course for a first away win since October the 4th. But Mevla Erding rescued a point for Sante in stoppage time as it finished 2 2. Iver, though, now without a win in six. Monaco gave themselves a lift ahead of Wednesday's Champions League last 16 first leg at Arsenal with victory in the Côte d'Azur derby at Nice. Bernardo Silva sweeping home the only goal of the Allianz Riviera on 85 minutes to hand Monaco a 1-0 win. Rennes waits for a win goes on after the Brittany club were held at home to Bordeaux. Paul Georgian Tepp's eighth goal of the season put Rennes in front 11 minutes in. But Wabi Kazri level from the penalty spot 13 minutes from time. It finished 1 1. Ren now without a victory in 10 games. Gangon suffered a European hangover as they came a cropper at home to Montpellier. Morgan Sanson put the visitors ahead after just two minutes at the Stade de Rudiru. And Kevin Berrigo netted a second for Roland Kubis' side 10 minutes after half time as Montpellier inched closer to the European places following a 2 0 win. Bastia showed no signs of slowing down as they came from behind to beat Lille in Corsica. Ryan Mendes' header gave Lille a 17th minute lead. But René Girard's side weren't in front for long as Giovanni Sio scored for the second game running to draw Bastia level. Forward Aite's Thunderbolt five minutes before the interval. Completing the turnaround for Gislain Canton's men. Bastia claiming a 2-1 victory, stretching their unbeaten run in the league to nine matches. Carl pulled further clear of the danger zone as their remarkable 2015 form continued at home to Lens. Julian Ferry's seventh minute penalty giving Carl an early lead at the Stad Michel Donano. A wonderful solo effort from Emiliano Sala doubled the host lead before Hervé Basile made it 3 0 on a 36 minutes after an error from Jean Philippe Jubama. Lens pulled one back on the stroke of half time through El Harbi Al Jediawi who followed up his missed spot kick. But a second from Salah and at 75 minutes made the point safe as Carl rocks to a 4 1 win. Carl now with five wins in their last six. The wait for a long overdue win goes on for both Rance and Metz after the sides played out a goalless draw. Rance's Asa Mendy indebted to his keeper Cossia Gassi after nearly staring into his own net with Nicola de Preville and able to find a way through at the other end as it finished 0 0. Evian's home fixture with fellow strugglers Lorient was called off after heavy snow in Annecy on Saturday left the Parc des Sports pitch unplayable. Here the match delegate explains the situation. The decision to postpone the match was taken in accordance with the referee, with the safety of the players and fans in mind. The date for the rearranged fixture will be determined by the league's competition committee in the next few days. Here's a recap of all the results from week 26 in Ligue 1. 22 goals across the nine games this week, with Caen continuing their incredible resurgence after thumping Lens, 
Mets without a win in 14 now, while Marseille lose ground in the title race. Marcelo Bielsa's men now four points behind leaders Leon after their draw at Sante. PSG stay two points off the pace while Monaco are up to fourth and have a game in hand at Bastia into the top half for the first time since week one. Nantes drop into the bottom half. Car up to 14th and now five points clear of the danger zone. A point for Mets, not enough to lift them off the foot of the table. Things looking bleaker with each passing week for both them and Lens. Marseille return home to kick off week 27 at home to Caen next Friday. Lyon then go to Lille on Saturday with Monaco hosting Paris Saint-Germain on Sunday night. Zlatan Ibrahimovic suspended for the trip to the Principality.